We have live pictures right now from a big meeting in Warrensburg where people are worried about a foul smell and possible water pollution, all from a proposed cattle feeding operation near Lone Jack. KNBC 9's Matt Fleener says among the concerns, what it'll mean for nearby Powell Gardens. We're not an art museum, but it's similar. Inside Powell Gardens Conservatory, the snapdragons and purple Joe pie are protected. You know, you would care for a painting or a sculpture. Well, we're caring for all of this plant life out here. But Powell so Gardens director insane. Tabitha Schmidt says outside there's a threat to the 970 acres here not far away. I mean, there's a lot at stake. Signs along 50 highway have gone up both against and for a proposed concentrated animal feeding operation. Up to 6,999 cattle fed and processed just over three miles west from Powell Garden. We're very concerned about groundwater and any just runoff, just water in general and how it could affect the gardens. A family farm called Valley Oaks is trying to do what every family farm aspires to do. They are trying to expand. Members of the Missouri Cattlemen's Association wanted to defend the family behind Valley Oaks today. And to answer your question about why they're not here, they told me their lawyers told them not to come today because they figured there'd be friction between opposition. Still, local farmers are standing up for them, saying they won't be bullied by neighbors or people at Powell Gardens. Of course, they have lots of large donors, and I guess they can fund, spend their uh, donation dollars however they wish, but, you know, this family's investing their dollars in this project and providing jobs to our local community. As for the folks so, at Powell Gardens, this is not something that can just happen without a major fight. They'll protect their land no matter what. In Johnson County, Missouri, Matt Fleener, KNBC 9 News.